everyone and welcome back to my channel. If you're new here, welcome. My name is Emma and um, if you are an existing subscriber, thank you again for your support. Today I thought I would just jump on and share with you the items that I've purchased from Radley recently. So there is um, a few bags and some purses as well and um, so yeah they're absolutely beautiful I just had to share them with you and um, they're not really expensive either yeah, they're not really expensive bags as well it is a realistic price range for Radley so yeah I'm just going to jump into the video and I really hope you enjoy it so the first few bags I purchased from Radley are actually from their Royal Ascot range and they're absolutely beautiful I love them so so much and um, they come in this beautiful dust bag here and um, it's a lovely white dust bag with navy detail on it so you have the like a horseshoe here you have um the champagne glasses you have the floral design there as well on here it does say 2020 because it's the royal ascot 2020 range that this is and you've got the radley and royal ascot logo on the bag as well I absolutely love this I feel like these colours the white and the navy look really really expensive they go so so nice together um, so if I open it up the first bag is this oh it's so so beautiful so it's this white bag here it's so so gorgeous I can't get over how beautiful it is it's just a lovely shape as well it's so so nice it's my favorite bag actually and um, i am quite tempted to go and get a backup of this one because uh i love this one so so much i'm going to be wearing it a lot and um, i feel like i should have one for when this one gets a bit worn um or if it gets damaged or anything like that so i have one as a backup if it gets ruined or anything hopefully it won't though i do look after the bags um, but yeah really really tempted to buy another one so yeah it's this lovely shaped bag here it's quite structured as well because it's not going to lose its shape or anything like that but I'm I do still put the stuffing inside um of bags even if they are a bit structured just so it can stay plump um and things like that but you've got the Radley logo here in gold you've got the gold hardware as well on this bag but it's like a champagne kind of gold it's absolutely beautiful and you've got the little radley dog here as well super super cute so you can either hold this bag on the handles here just in your hand or you do have a really long strap for crossbody um which is adjustable and it is removable as well so if you didn't want it on the bag at all you can just unclasp it like that and just have it as the bag like that um at the bottom i would be careful because it doesn't have any like studs like little feet to protect the leather so if you are putting this bag down anywhere um just be careful because it might get scratched or um you can even buy like little metal studs to put on the bottom yourself if you re re <laughs> spoon too fast you can buy um little metal studs if you want to put them on the bottom yourself just for the extra protect protection um you open it up with these two zips there like that and inside the lining is exactly like the dust bag absolutely beautiful with the white and navy on this side hopefully you can see you've got the little pouch here so you can put your cards in there. and on this side you have the zip one there and again it says Radley and Ascot inside um, and you can put your cards and maybe I don't think you'd fit your phone in there actually it is quite small but yeah obviously you can put your phone in there 
main compartment here but yeah it's absolutely beautiful i love it so so much my mum also got this one as well because she really really liked it and it was only 79 pound for this one which is an absolute bargain really considering it's real leather now the bag itself isn't that big and um, so you can't fit much stuff inside but you can fit the essentials so you can fit a phone in a purse a little bit of makeup um a little hairbrush if you've got the little ones that's meant for bags um so you can fit your essentials in but not much more than that it's absolutely beautiful just to throw on over your body and um, like cross body as well with a lovely summer skirt and things like that a summer dress it's absolutely beautiful so this one was 79 pound and like i said i'm tempted to go and get it back up because i absolutely love it and that one is called the half moon in the ascot range um, if you did want to look for it. The next bag I got um, is again from the Ascot range. It comes in exactly the same dust bag as the other one. Um, this is actually the same bag as the other one, just in yellow. Absolutely beautiful. I adore this one so much. It's not like a really bright yellow. It's more of like a lemony yellow, this one. Um, and again, it has the gold hardware but it's like the champagne gold so it's not super shiny you've got the radley logo here which is so so nice as well and you've got the little radley dog too there so this is exactly the same as the white one i've just shown you just in yellow um so yeah adjustable and you can remove the crossbody strap if you wanted to inside is exactly the same as well so you open it up, it's exactly the same. So you've got this pouch on this side and then the zip one on that side. But I feel like this is absolutely gorgeous for the summertime. Um, I, oh, let's move my foot, it's getting dead. Um, I actually have a yellow gingham dress that I love to wear in the summer. Um, so it's white and yellow and this just looks so, so nice with it. It's absolutely gorgeous and this um bag was actually only 47 pound so it was an absolute bargain i think it is just because of the color of it might not be to everyone's taste um with it being yellow but honestly it's so so beautiful it's absolutely gorgeous and again this is just a half moon one as well exactly the same for the bottom as well you don't have the little studs the feet so i would be careful if you were placing it down anywhere yeah absolutely beautiful they do actually do this style bag in quite a few different colors so they have the white and the yellow they also had a black which was nice um as well and they done it in a pink too now i would absolutely have loved this bag if the pink was a really like a light pink like a baby kind of pink but theirs was more of like bright hot pink um, and although it is so so beautiful I probably wouldn't wear a bright bag like that um, so yeah I got these two colours because I thought they were just so so nice absolutely beautiful and when I seen this one was only £47 I just could not leave it I was like I have to get that just because of how cheap it was as well um, so yeah absolute bargain for this one lovely for the summertime the next bag that i purchased from radley is also from the ascot range but this is the last ascot um item that i purchased and um, i do have some that's not in the ascot range and it's this beautiful beautiful bag here honestly it's so so gorgeous it's got the white and the navy here and you've got the champagne gold hardware and the Radley logo there. And it's this lovely like woven effect. It's so, so gorgeous. It really, really is. You've got the little dog here as well, which I think is really cute. I love, love the metal Radley dog. I think it's just adorable. Um, I do also like the um, leather material ones as well, um, but there's just something about the little gold one. It's just so, so cute. So yeah, 
absolutely gorgeous at the back here you do have a pouch so you can put a few items in there and the lining again is exactly the same as a dust bag so the white and navy which is so so stunning really really nice um, you do have a chain here so you can pop the shawl um, the shoulder you do have a chain here so you can pop it across your body or on your shoulder which is really really handy and it's just a lovely gold chain there and you can actually remove this if you wanted to and just carry the bag as a clutch in your hand so really really nice um to open the bag you just do that it's just magnets that's um keeping this bag closed so two magnets there inside you have a compartment here to put items in here you have the zip pocket as well there's the radley logo on and you also have a pouch here as well which you could fit a phone in there it's quite big or a mirror or some of your lipstick things like that it's absolutely gorgeous so this one does have a bit more room than the other ones i'm showed you um but again it's not a really really big bag um it's a clutch clutches aren't really big usually but yeah it's absolutely beautiful um again i think my mum bought this one for her as well we do have um similar tastes and things but yeah absolutely beautiful and um, i love this one so much as well so this one was a 59 pound which i thought was a real bargain for radley um especially considering they are real leather so yeah 59 pound for this one and it's just called the weave clutch hopefully you can see there so the weave clutch for this one the next bag i purchased i have actually took the stuffing out of all these bags just so you're not hearing me crinkle it all the time um so yeah because i know that can be a little bit annoying but the next bag it's not from the ascot range i'm not actually sure what the name of this one is um, because I have took the tag off and um, I did use it the other day um, but I will have a look for it um, and I'll pop it in the description down below um, just in case you did want to buy it yourself they do come in other colours as well and there was this lovely like dusty pink colour um, but I got it in the white it's so so pretty it's a lovely croc print there you've got the Radley at the top in silver hopefully you can see you've got the little leather radley dog there and a like a hexagon um like plastic hex hexagon thing and i'm not really sure what to call it so thing will do um but yeah it's so so beautiful the dog is actually gray um which i think is a lovely contrast with the white so so gorgeous that's what the back looks like you do have a pouch here but you can't really open it and um, so I probably wouldn't put anything in there because it will be a struggle to get it back out but yeah there is a pouch there Um, you again you can either hold it by the handles here in your hand or you do have the crossbody as well which is adjustable can see and you can remove this as well if you didn't want it hanging down um like if you didn't want to use it inside you have two compartments here so you've got one there and one there that you can put items in or you have the the zip one which is a bit more secure with a being a zip so you just zip it down and that's what it's like inside so you've got the zip compartment here you can put your cards in and things like that with a little radley dog and then you've got this pouch on this side as well to put things in um, and then all of that section there which is 
quite big this one's much bigger than the ones i've shown you in this bag as well the lining is just the classic pink that they've got which is really really nice these um all of the radley bags do come in dust bags usually this one didn't for me um but i did have a spare one luckily so i can put it in there and um, just because this one was an x display one um so they didn't have any dust bags left for it but i have one spare upstairs so yeah it's fine the dust bag that i would usually come in though is just um the pink one i don't have it with me at the moment um but yeah just a pink one with the radley logo on the front at the bottom of this bag as well again it doesn't have any feet unfortunately um so if you do get it i would just be careful with the surfaces that you're putting it on because it can get scratched um so yeah it's quite a structured bag as well it's not gonna flop or anything like that if you didn't put any stuffing back inside of it um but i would always recommend putting the stuffing back inside when you're not using it um just so it lasts a bit longer so yeah absolutely beautiful and this one was only 59 pound as well yeah 59 pound for this one so again absolutely beautiful beautiful bargain the next item i purchased from radley is a purse so it does come in its own little dust bag as well which is so so cute it's got the radley logo on so this is the dust bag that the white bag would have just at a, like a bigger scale um but yeah so so pretty the purse as well is gorgeous it's this lovely black one here you've got the radley logo in gold the little zip as well i love how it's white like that's just a lovely contrast against the black you open it up you just lift this up like that and inside you've got the white leather there you got this um zip pouch here and you can put your coins in then you can just zip it back up like that and this pouch here you can put your cards in um there are at the side here and at the side there you've got the compartments for your cards and you even have a small one at the back here like that so yeah i thought this was so so beautiful Um, it is quite a small purse um, but most of my bags aren't very big um, so i do just want a small one so i can fit more um more items in the bag um but they do come in a larger style um as well if you wanted i think it's about that big maybe yeah from like this end to my finger there so yeah it's just a bit longer that one was really really nice as well but like i said i've got quite small bags um so i just wanted a small purse i could fit more items in my bag like a brush and makeup and things like that so yeah this one was only 20 pound as well it does have a, a pouch at the back too like a pocket at the back of the purse but yeah 20 pound for this i thought that was so so cheap um i don't actually think i've seen a bradley purse for 20 pound um before so yeah i really was not missing that deal um I'm not sure what the name of this purse is. Um, I'll have a look and I'll put it in the description box as well so that you can find it. Um, I did also get it in the white as well, which I thought was so, so pretty. Um, so again, you've got the Radley logo at the bottom, which is gold. I do like to buy things um, like the same item in all of the colours that's possible um, because I just fall so in love with it um so yeah that is an issue that i've got um so yeah i got this white one again it's exactly the same as the other one but you've got the tan brown to contrast with this cream i say white it is cream actually so yeah you've got the tan um inside it's exactly the same compartment so you can put your cards in that side and in that side You've got the pouch here at the back and the zip one here so you can put your coins in 
just open it so you can have a quick look. There. Oh, there we go. I'm not sure if you can see the lining in there. It's got the lovely little Radley dogs on, which is so, so cute. So yeah, I think it might be that the same in the black one as well. Let's have a quick look. Yeah, so the black one also has the lining of the Radley dogs. I'm not sure if the camera will pick it up, but they they are really, really cute. Um, and yeah, the zip on this one is the tan as well. And again, this one was £20 too. So both of these are £20 each. And um, they did do it in a few other colours. There was a grey one and like a khaki green one as well, which were really nice. And I was tempted to get them because I do have a grey bag and I'd love to have a grey purse to go with it. Um, I quite like matching my bags and my purses together. Um, but that one wasn't on the sale, um, so it was a bit more expensive. Um, I think it was between £30 and £40, so I, I didn't really want to spend that much on it. Um, so I'm going to keep an eye out and see if it gets reduced any further. And I'll probably send them going back for it, um, if they do reduce it. But yeah, £20 each for these, and if you don't want the small... They do come in the bigger size as well. So yeah, for the white bag and like the white croc bag and the two purses, I'll leave the name of them in the description box below if you did want to purchase them yourselves. Um, just so it's a bit easier for you to find the items. So that is everything that I purchased from Radley recently. I hope you have all enjoyed the video and thank you so much for watching it. Um, if you have enjoyed it, please do remember to give me a like, comment down below and please think about subscribing to the channel as well. It really would mean a lot to me. I am going to be coming on with a bit more content with um, hauls and things like that, um, especially like baby wear and things like that too. So yeah, if that's something that interests you, I'd love to see you um, again in the future and please subscribe. Um, but that's it from me today. I hope you enjoy the rest of your week and I'll see you again next time. Bye!